what is up guys so in this video i'm currently at the acme parking lot where the fire prevention expo is taking place and um looks like they're doing a demonstration right now but um so in this video you're going to be seeing me just walk around the um, parking lot and take checking out the trucks here and, and some of the cars and maybe i'll get the kids to go inside some of these guys so oh i'm sorry for that yeah, I'm gonna get a chance to ride and go inside of some of these trucks. So let's start off with Rescue 6. All right guys, here is Rescue 6. So um, this is part of the Low Southampton Fire Department and this is their newest truck and their apparatus. So let's take a look, oh, let's take a walk around here to the back here. This is where some of the um, gear, it, like stuff is, like this is like where like the hoses and stuff like that and some of the materials here. And there's like a little pumper here. And then here's the cab over here. I have to take another walk around to the front. You can see there's like, um, we'll, we'll, just take, we'll just go around here. Yeah, so we'll, there's a there's an axe here, there's shovels, and there's more stuff on the back here. And as we take a look here, there's some ladder stuff right here. And then we got over here, with we got some more stuff here. They like got the jaw supply for that can help people get out of the cars here. Um, and then we got some chainsaws up here. And then here's their actual pumper where they can like hook up like the fire hose and stuff like that. And then here's the cap all the way up there. So, um, um, so I just, sorry about that. Um, so once I get to the point where I get inside of SP6, I'll show you guys the inside of SP6. All right guys, so we're just gonna skip the videos of myself inside the trucks. So we're just gonna just take a look on the, along the outside of each vehicle. So next up we have is Chief 6, which is the newest car in the apparatus here. It's a Ford F-150 here. Um, yeah, there's a Ford F-150. And um, we have number six on the back here. Um, this thing's like one of the newest cars. And I'll show you guys the other side of the car here. Let's go around here. Yep, so the, this is like a demonstration vehicle. And here's the other side. I might not, not be allowed to go around here. So we're just gonna take a look through the window, but the inside is like here. We got, um, this is basically like where the lights are and stuff like that. That's where basically some of the lights are and like some other stuff in the back. Excellent so, job. Something all right. Came out of Thank you. All right, looks like. 1.30, we will be doing our auto extrication drill behind the PJ booth at Rescue 6. We still got 20 minutes for that or so. Uh, Alright guys, so there's good so, so the uh, chief Patrick, the, here. Uh, the, thank you for coming, thank you for your support. Alright guys, so that was the chief of Feast of Bell. He was talking about another demonstration coming up. So let's take a look at our next vehicle. Next up is a fire marshal, which is fire marshal 243. This is another Ford vehicle, I think. Yeah, it's a Ford F two hundred fifty. Ford F two fifty. And uh, this is technically like Chief Six, but it's a fire marshal. So if you can look inside, you might not be able to look inside, but and then we have over here, we got some a little thing here for like people to stick their heads inside of the hole there. And on the other side, we have, um, here's the other side of the marshal here. It's technically the same thing. And then as we took a look to the back side, it's just basically like a door for like where people can get their equipment and stuff like that. So that's um okay. Alright, so let's take a look at our next right, next vehicle on the list is Deputy Six from Low Southampton again. So this is um Deputy Six. Um it doesn't really say the name I think. But um we got Low Southampton right there. This thing used to be called Trivo Sites, the fire company. There's six on the side here. And then let's take a look at the front here. Um, it's, it's another Ford vehicle, and um, it doesn't. It just basically get another car. And here, I'll take. A, I'll just take a look at the inside, just to say, guys. Um, let's take a look here. Looks like they got some more buttons for the lights, and um, here's the back, which is basically empty seats. So let's take a look at our next vehicle. All right, next vehicle on the list is the Chief of Try Hit the Rescue Squad. Um, it's Chief of Try Hit the Rescue Squad. And here's the inside, so it's basically like um, where the buttons for the lights are. Um, here's the back side right here. Um, it's just, I really don't have much explaining here. So here's the front of the, it's another Ford here. 
Um, this is stainless. This is the same exact car as G4 for Trivos. And here's the other side out here. All right, so let's take a look at our next car. Right, our next vehicle here we have is an Amens from Trihenta Rescue Squad. Um, it's another Ford here. Man, there's like so many Fords. Like, I just, I just can't stand it. I'm just gonna take a look. I'm just gonna show you this side because uh, there's kids on the other side. And I really don't want to film them. So here's the other side of the ambulance here. Looks like I don't see the number, but yeah, I don't know what the number is for this unit. So um, uh, yeah, try to rescue squad one, one one four. That's basically the station. Then there's a new station along Bustleton Pike. This is the one along Bustleton Pike, and um, there's a station one one four. So. Um, and the next truck will be another fire truck, but this time it's going to be from Feastaville. So uh, let's get to our next view. All right, so next up is Engine 1 here. So Engine 1 is just going to be standing here along the road here, just to make sure that, that, that this truck is staying just for calls. So I can't get up close to it. I just think there's going to be cars driving by here. So Edge One would just be staying for calls and maybe possibly a fire demonstration this could probably gonna be. So let's go to our next vehicle, which is gonna be engine six over here. Cause yeah, I'm like right next to it. So we're just gonna just keep rolling with the video so we can check out our like the oldest engine in Low Southampton. This is a um this is a 1992 This is a 1992 Pierce Dash. So we can take a look around the truck. This looks like one of the doors are open. Um this is the Marine Rescue, but let's take a look at that later. Um, here we got, here we got the front here. We got E6 on the front here, and um, here's the Q sign right there. And they saying they they put this truck up for sale. Oh, Southampton did, and um, there's good. They're going to be it with a newer one, which is probably a Rosenbauer, just like Rescue. Which is the, technically the, the technically the brand that's going to look like Rescue Six. As they're coming in 2024, so let's go to our next vehicle. Next vehicle on the list is Rescue 4 of Chivas Fire Company. So, um, as you see, pretty car. So, I'm gonna just do a quick video here, get some of the gadgets up. And here's the pumper right there. Um, and here's some more materials here. We got the Jaws of Life on this side. We got there's like a little hose on the side. We got the more hoses and there's ladders up there. And I'm on the other side here. We got some more materials here. And um, we got some more materials here. Let's take a look at the next one. All right, next up is Marine Rescue. I don't think I got this one. But we're gonna take a walk around uh, Marine Rescue. So Marine Rescue right there. And Marine has actually has a little trailer here on the back. Uh, oh, sorry. So this thing's a support unit. So here's the trailer over here. It's just the inside. This is basically where the boat, I think, goes. Like, during, if there's like a big dive team or something, here's the boat that they have here. Here's the boat they have. And then, and then here's, uh, here's another look on the inside here. And then here's the Marine Rescue again. Um, here's a look on the back here for Marine. And then I'm gonna come around again to the front. Okay, we got a five minute warning for the old education. Everybody start making their way behind the DJ booth to rescue six. I'll be turning over to Chief Brooks. He'll be doing a play by play on this. Alright, so this is Marine Rescue. It looks like they're going to be doing another demonstration. So let's go to the next video, which is going to be one of the ladders. Alright, next up on the list is ladder one here. So um, I'm sorry you can't start it from the back, but this is the best they could do for ladder one so far. So we're going to go from back to front. Um, so here's the back ladder one where all the other ladders are. We got the stabilizers here that hold ladder one up. So you won't so the ladder one won't fall. And as we go on this side here, there's some more equipment over here. This is a stabilizer. And then and then we have some more equipment here. We got some extinguishers, we got some more tools here. We got some chainsaws and stuff like that. And then we got the cab here as you walk to the front here. As we walk to the front. I walk to the front here, we got the one here. And as you can see down here, that's a train horn, as you can see under there. And, um, yeah, guys, so that's the one. And then our next video will be Quint's checks coming soon. All right, guys, so as you can see, before we move on to the next truck on the inside of the one right now, 
um, just basically where all the buttons are like, to get the lights on and working like that. Um, got some nice stuff on the other side there. We got a string here that cost me the air horn. And here's the steering wheel here. We got the, the little buttons here. And there's like other, there's like fighters and stuff. And there's like six more seats in the back. And, uh, and there's like some stuff in here with walk scanners and walkie talk, walkie talkies. So yeah, um, let's move on to Quinn 6 now. Alright, our final vehicle of the video will be Quinn 6. Um, because just the kids um, are starting to come back from demonstrations and they're going to start like lining up to get into the truck. So we're going to do this really quickly. So the Quinn 6 is, um, has the pump right in the middle just like any other engine could. Um, as you see on the other side here, we have another stabilizer with like, more gear. But it, the, those things aren't open. Those doors aren't open. As you go over here, we have some stuff open here. We got like some more tools here. We got some, we got um, medic bags and stuff like that. So, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this Fire Prevention Expo video. Please like, subscribe, and um, stay tuned for more videos coming really soon. Sorry guys, but before the video ends, we're actually I forgot to um, show you guys Engine One Two and Utility One. So as you can see, we have Engine One Two here with a fire hose over here. That's basically just used for this house right here, like for kids to put out the fires here. Um, we got some of the gears here. And um, I was talking to one of the firemen for Feastville, and they said that they're planning, they're talking to themselves about that selling one of their engines here. Yeah, here's the supply line to a fire extinguisher that's up there somewhere. They're actually planning on selling one of the engines. They were thinking about that, but I just wanted to keep the amount of trucks that they have right now, like four in the station. Now, if you tilted one here. Um, it's another Ford year. This one's like, this one was the one that carried Santa back in 2017. Like, just the, so I'm guessing this one's used, just, Santa goes up there when it's like rainy outside. Okay, we got utility one here. Here's the front of engine one two. With like, the E one two here, the Q siren and the air horns. Then here's the back of utility. Feast of Fire Company. So now that's the end of the video. So please like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos coming along.